got hold of this new Xperia Z phone and uh, I'm, I'm currently using the Xperia Neo V so I just thought let's just take a look at what the features are whether they've had added something new into this uh, currently I've not been very happy with my Xperia Neo V because it started giving me a lot of trouble in terms of its speed there's a lot of lag after I started using it it's become very slow which makes it very difficult for me to use it so just I just compared it uh, with the new Xperia like the Xperia phones it's very chic and very stylish uh, it's got a very camera a very good camera as well uh, what uh, other feature that, that I liked about it is that it has a very good uh, uh, it's, it's water and dust resistant uh, but given an option I wouldn't go for an Xperia phone again because I've had a lot of troubles with my current phone which is Xperia Neo V the only thing I like about the phone is its light and weight and though being an octocore, uh, a quad core processor, it still lags. Uh, the camera quality is also not, not that good compared to my phone. Uh, being a 30 megapixel, the contrast and the image is not that clear as compared to the Nokia Lumia 820. If given a chance, I would rather go for the Nokia Lumia 820 than the Sony Xperia Z. It's really a big phone to get a hold of. I mean, you don't feel comfortable looking at the handset or holding it in your hands. I'm currently using the Samsung Galaxy S3. Now, if you have to compare it to the Samsung Galaxy S3, the phone seems to be lagging. Given an option of buying the Sony Xperia Z, I really wouldn't prefer spending 38 grand on such a phone. I would rather shell out a little bit more and buy the iPhone 5, or I would rather prefer the Samsung Galaxy S4. Uh, speaking about this phone, this phone uh, as it says has got uh, 1080 uh, pixel screen resolution but honestly speaking it doesn't seem like. Also uh, there has got camera of 30 megapixel with something called as X more but uh, speaking about this uh, the camera is not that brilliant. The only good thing about this phone is uh, as it says it is uh, dust proof and waterproof but uh, as you can see it doesn't seem like. So, even if I have to buy a phone in this range, I would rather settle down for iPhone uh, 5 or uh, S4 or rather Lumia 920. Coming soon, the full review on techtree.com.